Good morning. It's a beautiful, snowy, cold day in Boston. I'm very excited to get outside and do some work. But first, a package came in. Let's open it. Oh, cute. This is so cool. So it's another sustainable clothing brand. This one's called Lazé. Lazé, please. L-E-Z-E. -E. Uh, Taylor, thanks to you, one pounds of abandoned fishing nets are given a second chance to become a closet staple. That is so cool. Awesome. Let's check it out. This is so nice. It's like some of the nicest fabric I've experienced. Oh my gosh, look at this hoodie. Okay, I'm gonna put this on. This is super soft. I can't believe it was once fishing nets. That's wild, okay. Ooh, that's awesome. Lize, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. Thank you so much, I love this. This is so cool, I'll be wearing it a ton. So, new hoodie, awesome. Next up on the to-do list is something I do frequently. It's sort of for work, sort of not. It's laundry, which is like essential if you're wearing a ton of clothes and putting on a ton of clothes all the time. So let's do it. Spooky hallway. Next, I'll have a quick breakfast and we'll get ready to go. Let's get dressed. I wanna wear this hoodie, but I need an undershirt. So I'll grab one. I have my dad's old t-shirt. It's kind of wrinkly. I don't really care. It's just gonna be on the bottom layer. So it's nice to wear stuff that has a story to it that belonged to a family member and it's close to my heart. So I like having it on. Then of course, the new hoodie. I wanna wear pants that sort of match this color. So I have this brown pair from Abercrombie. I think they'll go well. Okay, these are the pants. You can see the colors look pretty good together so far. So nice. For shoes, I already had on white socks. I think I need white shoes to go with that. I'm gonna rock these. These are the steppers for today and that is what they look like with the outfit. Nice. I'm actually gonna change the t-shirt really quickly. I think I have one that'll suit the vibe better in case I have to take the hoodie off if I get too warm. I switched to a shirt that I made with my little skull dude on it, which I like better for today. While I wait for the laundry to finish, I'm gonna start cleaning out my closet. I'm trying to give away and sell a bunch of old clothes and sneakers that I just don't wear anymore. These are all donations. These are things I might sell. I only wanna sell things that I have a hard time getting rid of, sort of, so I have an incentive to actually like clear out that space. But for donations, I hope that people who need these can get use out of them. Now we have a proper bag and some more stuff. We have some old sneakers I don't wear, some really cool loafers, hoodies, of course, some vintage denim, a lot of shirts down there, and this sick old L.L. Bean, like, big giant ski jacket that I just don't wear enough. So I don't know where to put those things up on sale. Let me know if you have a preferred, like, thing like Grail, Depop, Poshmark, whatever it is. Let me know. But this will all be up for sale at some point in the near future. The side effect of the cleanout is that I now have more space to put all my stuff and I have a lot more space in my display case. So I'm gonna rearrange this at some point today, maybe now, maybe later. I think the laundry's done, so we have to grab that first. Spooky hallway, once again. I literally went outside to see how cold it was and it was way too cold for just a hoodie. So big puffer, thank you to Industry Australia for sending it and the Noah Beanie, good to go. So I handle all my emails in the morning usually, which means in the afternoon, it's just time to either record content, edit content, or work on my coding class and other business ventures. So. Today, the main focus is coding. Time to just get down to work on my computer. I'm doing it at a cafe, because it's nice. Okay, we are back, time to settle in. My hair is always a mess after wearing a beanie. The only solution I found is to shave my head, which I'm not doing again. So, at least not yet. Everything so far today has been pretty standard, like a normal day. So now that I'm settling in, I'd like to show you how I break up the monotony. Well, the first thing I do, I guess, is I go to cafes and like order a nice little cup of tea, whatever it is, and try to do work there. And that breaks up some of what I do. Usually I work from home, but I try to show you guys when I go out because it's more interesting. The next thing I like to do is refresh my surroundings. As you can see, new lamp over there, and we can reorganize this now. Let's do it. First, I think I need books up here because it'll look very good. So let's do it. Good start. Next, different books up there. 
books are there. I think I need the bookend because they're sort of falling over. I've moved my like must read list over to the other side of my room. So we need something to hold those there. I sort of jammed this boxing glove in. I don't know if that'll last forever. I kind of want something else there, but good start. I'll spare you the explanations as I go through the rest of it. You guys can just watch. Ultimately, I like it better already, but there's a lot of open space. Not sure what to do with it. Okay, I populated the spaces with boots for the time being, and I fit my skateboard on there too, so it's at least full. I want to refine it more. I want to organize the books by color. Honestly, I just want to fill it with books, so that would be a project for another day. The next thing I do is change up the scent and sound of my space. My girlfriend gave me this gorgeous incense, so let's burn some. Ignore the old incense ashes. Now let's pick a record. My usual go-to to relax is Mezzanine by Massive Attack. It's an amazing album. I also have this Joni Mitchell live album, which is pretty solid. Let's not go for Sufjan Stevens today. Don't need that. I think ultimately it's gonna be Ramblin' Rose by Nat King Cole, which is right here. This is definitely heavily copyrighted, so I won't be playing it on here with y'all. Very sorry about that. Definitely listen to it on Spotify. Also check those out and check out my Spotify. It's in my link tree. I have a ton of good playlists there. I'll be making more soon, so keep an eye out. I'm realizing now that breaking the monotony of daily life for me is more about self-care than anything else. The final component for me usually is to read a good book. I'll be signing off in a second so I can enjoy the lovely setup I just made for myself, but first let me leave you with some book recommendations. The First Dune is my favorite book of all time. This is the third book in the series and they're excellent. Like one, two, and three have all been good. I've heard four, five, and six are great too. Definitely worth checking out if you like sci-fi. I just started reading Marcus Aurelius's Meditations. It's excellent. If you're ever interested in Stoicism or just philosophy in general, this is a great read. I'm loving it so far. My all-time favorite poet is E.E. E. Cummings. If you've never read E.E. E. Cummings, he plays with words in an extraordinary way. I'd highly recommend it. It's very different from most poetry you read nowadays. Very innovative. I've said this before, but anything by Kurt Vonnegut. Slaughterhouse-Five is a good place to start. I started with Sirens of Titan, which I recommend. One of those two is a good entryway. If you like weird literature, like I do, I love weird books, the weirder the better, honestly. Jitterbug Perfume is the best I've ever read in the weird category. Tom Robbins is an absolute menace of an author, and this is his finest work. The last one is a book that has shaped how I see the world, for better or for worse. It's The Stranger by Camus. I know it's a typical pick. I know you might see it as a red flag. It's a wonderful book. It's worth reading, at least to see what the perspective is. That is it for today. Another time I'll show you all the books on my currently reading pile. It's, it's a whole pile. Uh, I like to read four or five things at once, so we'll save that for next time. I'm gonna go settle in with Dune. Thank you so much for joining me, and as always, have a great day. Mm -hmm.